spring 2021 season, Kokatat is excited to introduce a new Gore-Tex Pro fabric in our dry suits, dry tops, bibs, and pants. For the last three seasons, we've been working with WL Gore and our team athletes to develop this fabric. Testing has shown that it produces the most rugged, comfortable, and breathable garments for PAL sports yet. Here's some testimonials from our team testers. For more information, go to kokatat.com. Hey everyone, Carson Lindsay here. Uh, I've been using the new Gore-Tex fabric in a dry suit for the last six months here in California. Paul Kuthi here out in Washougal, Washington. Clay Wright, and I'm a kayaker with Jackson Kayak here in Rock Island, Tennessee. Hey guys, my name's Darby, and I just want to give you a quick review of Kokatat's new Gore Pro fabric in their dry suits. I teach swift water courses, and I've been paddling as much as I can. I've been super stoked on how the fabric's been working so far. It's feeling good. You know, I first checked it out. I was pulling it out of the box, and I was really noticing, wow, this is this is stiffer. This is going to be uh, a little bit less pliable. wasn't sure how it was going to feel on, but uh, I threw it on, and I, I don't even know the difference, really. But what I do notice is just how much more lightweight it feels. The uh, suit was dry, just like all the Kokatat Gore-Tex suits. It stayed dry for the three months that I've tested it. I went down to 22 degrees and had ice all over me, had to hike two and a half miles in the suit at one point, um, and the performance was right exactly what I expect from Gore-Tex. I think one of the big improvements um, in this fabric is the durability. So the suit held up super well. I think you can actually tell in the fabric itself um, that it's a little bit thicker and a little bit stiffer than other Gore-Tex fabrics. Um, and I think it just held up really well, especially in the socks, in the feet, and in the legs. Um, it seems to be super durable, keep me super warm, super dry, super breathable. Um, so, like I said, I've been loving it so far. Uh, it feels pretty burly, and the breathability seems good. But what I really, really notice is how much more lightweight it is. So it is a little more stiff, uh, but I feel like it's going to last a little bit longer. Super top notch. The only differences I can think of is it possibly is a little bit stiffer. It seems to hover over your body just a little bit more, which in the whitewater realm I really liked because in the whitewater, it's the water that's cold. So a wet suit on your body can, everywhere it touches, you feel the cold just a little bit more. And in this suit, I felt just a hair warmer on the coldest days that I paddled, which I really liked. I think another big improvement of the suit is the breathability. I had some really hot days while I was down on the Baker and on the Fuda, and I just felt that this suit um, could breathe a little bit better than other Gore-Tex designs while still being really waterproof um, and, you know, top of the line Gore-Tex material. This suit is feeling, uh, it's feeling lighter, it's feeling more burly, and it's certainly dry, so I'm loving it so far. I like it. I can't wait to get it back. Um, I absolutely love the suit, and I hope you guys do too. Can't wait for all of you to get your hands on it as well, for all the new stuff to come out. So hope you guys stay warm, stay dry, stay safe, and I'll see you on the river.